Well, good day there, everybody. Here we have um, one of those door door chain thingamajigs, jigs, and I guess it fixes onto the door frame like so for the chain to slide in that mechanism. Door would open and close this way, I guess. You'll all be familiar with these. I'm not so familiar with them because. I've never actually had one in use. Um, little four pin lock in there. I've got no idea what brand it is. And I'm going to be using a homemade short hook. And because it's situated on the door like so, on the door frame, I'll uh, pick it in the same position. This might go really quick, but I have a backup plan. <laughs> okay. One. Two. Three. Four. And there it is. Okay, well I thought that would go fairly quick, so I have a backup plan. Here we have a <laughs> uh, another relatively small padlock jack hammer. <laughs> Whoever Jack is, what's on? The, oh, nothing on the bottom. Just jack hammer. It's a fairly simple little little thing. <laughs> But because that went too quick on that door chain, I guess I'll make better do something with this time on the video. Tight little keyway, as they usually are on these things. In fact, yeah. One, I think. Two. Probably in shadow there, I don't know. Where do I get to? Two, I think. Three, yes. Three. That might be the wrong one. I'll get one with a bit of a more slope on the hook. No, I don't know where Just basically jiggle it around anyway. And it'll eventually pop open. Maybe if I turn the hook around the other way. Might actually uh, open it. I think that sets a couple of pins anyway. And I can turn the hook back the right way. And pick the. I think my tension wrench is a bit too thick. There it is. There it goes. Okay. Well, there it is. Right. Cheers. Thanks for watching that, fellas. Hooroo.